Hello! Today we're going to do a walkthrough of Video Notes. Spelled out, you'll see it as video not dot es. This is a fantastic Chrome extension and web service that allows you to watch videos and take notes at the same time. With the extension, you can take notes if you're watching videos using Udacity. It stores your notes in Google Drive, allowing you to access them anytime you want at a later date. So if you're involved in any kind of online research, or if you're a student, you might find this tool incredibly valuable. So let's take a quick look at how these services work. To get started, we need to head over to the Chrome Web Store, where we're going to search for Video Notes. Once we find it here, I'm going to click this button to install it. Now we're going to show you the basic idea of how this product works through their web platform instead of the extension, because I don't have a Udacity membership, but if you do, the principle is exactly the same. So here's the website. From here I can connect the service to my Google account so that all of my notes will save right to my Google Drive. Now all I have to do is take a URL from any video that I wish to take notes on. I'm going to use this TED Talk here, and then load the video into the interface. Now I can start taking notes over here. You'll see that each note comes with a timestamp, so that I can see where exactly in the video my note is referring to. This is a great way to make the most out of online courses and learning material, and is something that I think anyone can make some use out of. You can use these controls to save your notes, sync to Evernote, or start a new note session. Another really cool feature is the share feature right here. Because your notes are stored in Google Drive, you can click on share and get a very familiar Google app sharing window, where you can share your notes with anyone who might be interested. So again, if you're currently a Udacity member, you can use the Chrome extension in browser to enable this same functionality. This is only an alpha version of the extension, so greater functionality may or may not be on the way. But for now, the website's a great alternative, and it's just overall a great tool. Hopefully you found this helpful. If you have any questions, just let us know in the comments section below. Thanks for watching, and have a great day.